Dante Williams here at Memorial Stadium for the Northern Sea Divisional Finals. Plenty of athletes have already met the state qualifying marks, but for those that haven't, this is their last chance. The boys' 110 hurdles had belts J.D. Shepard and Chinook's Levi Jensen side by side in the lanes and on the timesheet. Jensen finished at 15.9 and Shepard with a very slight edge, taking first at 15.88. Girls 100 meter hurdles came down to Bridget Reed from Turner and Claire Buckland from Sunburst. Reed came in at 1679, right behind Buckland, who takes the cake with 1608. CJI's Jayla Ramberg jumped 33 feet 3 inches in the triple jump, which was good enough to place her in the top two. But Cascades, Braden Johnson went 33 feet 7 inches for the first place mark. Boys 800 meters got underway with Clayton Jassen and Ryan Doyle leading the pack. Jassen made his move around 600 meters to move into first and got a good lead. Doyle was down but not out. In the last 100 meters, he got a second win and reclaimed the lead before crossing the finish line at 2 minutes 1.141 seconds. Cascades' Kata Sakatirski broke a 50-year divisional triple jump record by over a foot. He jumped 45 feet, 10 and a half inches to ink his name into the history books. That's a wrap for the Northern Sea Divisional Meet. The state meet will be taking place on May 26th and 27th at Laurel. In Great Falls, crossing the finish line, I'm Dante Williams, MTN Sports.